everyone welcome back my youtube channel ncrt math sub today in this video we will do worksheet number 54 for class 10 subject mathematics today in this video we are going to learn about area of combination of plane figures so we have learned to calculate the areas of different figures separately let's learn to calculate the area of combination of plane figures so example of such figures are flower beds drain covers window design and rangoli design etc so first of all understand about quadrant a quadrant is one fourth of a circle made by two radii at the right angles and connecting arcs so quadrant ke hai circle ka one fourth part hai keep in mind so now example number one from each corner of a square of side four centimeter a quadrant of circle of radius one centimeter is cut and also a circle of diameter two centimeter is cut from the center as shown in figure so find the area of remaining portion of the square so we have square of side 4 cm and quadrant of radius 1 cm is cut from each corner of the square and a circle of diameter 2 cm is cut from the center. So these four quadrants will make a circle and this center circle we have. So we are to subtract the two circles, area of two circles from the area of square to find the area of shaded region. So area of remaining portion will be equal to area of square minus area of middle circle and you can say plus area of four quadrants so area of a b c d will be equals to side into side so area of square will be side into side that is four into four becomes 16 square, centimeter square and radius of inside circle will be equals to one centimeter so area of inner circle will be pi r square so 22 by 7 into 1 into 1 become 22 by 7 centimeter square so now we know that area of four quadrant will be equals to area of circle so the key this four quadrant will make a circle so area of circle will be 22 by 7 centimeter square as radius is one unit therefore area of remaining shaded portion will be equals to area of square that is 16 centimeter square minus area of central circle and area of four quadrant that is 22 by 7 and 22 by 7 so after simplifying we will get 68 by 7 centimeter square as the area of shaded region so now we have example number two on a square handkerchief nine circular design of radius seven centimeter each are made find the area of remaining portion of the handkerchief so we have number of circular design as nine radius of each circular design we have as seven centimeter so number of circular design on one side of the square handkerchief will be three so side of square will be three into diameter of circle so you can see the diameter of three circle will make the side of square so side of square will be 3 into diameter of each circle that is 3 into 14 become 42 so side of square is 42 centimeter so area of square will be side into side that is 42 into 42 that is 1764 centimeter square is the area of square so now area of circle will be pi r square so 22 by 7 into r square becomes 7 into 7 so after simplifying it will be 154 centimeter square so now total area of design will be area of 9 circles that is 9 into 154 that is area of each circle this will become 1386 centimeter square so now area of remaining portion of handkerchief will be equals to area of square minus area of 9 designs or you can say area of design area of 9 circle you can say so area of square is 1764 minus area of 9 design or you can say area of design that is 9 circle is equals to 1386 so after subtracting we will get as 378 centimeter square as the area of remaining handkerchief so this is all about example number two so now example number three you can see on the screen that is you can see here in figure there are two circular flower beds on the sides of square lone abcd of side 56 centimeter if the center of each circular flower bed is 0.2 of intersection O of the diagonals of the square lawn, find the sum of the areas of lawn and flower beds. So we have to find the sum of area of square square lawn and flower beds. So total area will be area of OAB. You can see area of sector OAB here. This area and plus area of sector ODC. This area and plus area of triangle OAD and area of triangle OBC. So area of square loan ABCD will be side into side that is 56 into 56 meter square as now let OA equals to OB as A meter. So triangle OAB is right angle triangle as right angle at O as we know that diagonals of square 
bisect each other, each other at right angle or intersect each other at right angle. So therefore a square plus a square equals to 56 into 56. So therefore 2a square will be equals to 56 into 56 and a square will be 28 into 56 meter square. So now area of sector OAB equals to area of sector ODC will be equals to area of quadrant. So therefore this will be equals to theta upon 360 into pi r square. So put all the values here 90 upon 360 into pi r square and pi is 22 by 7. So 90 upon 360 become 1 by 4 and pi 22 by 7 and here this is area of this is a square equals to 28 into 56 meter square. So now as OAD in triangle OAD angle AOD equals to 90 degrees so that angle of area of triangle OAD will be equals to 1 by 4 of 56 into 56 this will be also equals to area of OBC. So now from 3 and 4 and after simplifying you will get the required area as 4032 meter square that is the required area. So now we have three questions for practice so let's move ahead for solution part. The first part we are given fill in the blanks so area of sector is theta upon 360 into pi r square and area of quadrant is you know 1 by 4 pi r square so area of sector you can see here we have two radii of radius r unit and this is center point o this is a b arc so angle theta is at center so area of this sector will be equals to theta upon 360 into pi r square and area of quadrant so area of quadrant quadrant you know fourth part of circle so area of quadrant will be 1 by 4 of area of circle that is 1 by 4 part of pi r square and area of segment that is area of sector minus area of triangle so now we have question number two that is in figure a b c d is a square of side 28 centimeter with the centers a b c d each circle touch externally two of the remaining circles find the area of shaded region so we are to find the area of shaded region you can see here we have four circles and each circle touching other two circles other two circles out of three externally so we need to find this area and we are having this square of side 28 centimeter so we are given side of square abcd as 28 centimeter and radius of each circle equals to you can see here radius of circle will be the half of side of abc abcd square so that is side of square is 28 so 28 by 2 becomes radius of circle that is 14 centimeter so we have radius of circle as 14 centimeter area of shaded region will be area of square minus area of four quadrants you can see here we have four quadrants these are the quadrants so area of square minus area of four quadrants and area of square is side square and area of four quadrant will be four into area of each quadrant that is one by four of pi r square four four will be cancelled so these four quadrants you can see directly this four quadrant will make a square uh, will make a circle so that is pi r square so side of square is 28 so 28 square here pi 22 by 7 and radius is 14 so 14 into 14 so after simplifying 28 square become 784 and 22 into 2 become 44 into 14 become 616 so after simplifying we will get the remaining area as 168 centimeter square that is area of shaded region so now question number three Find the area of shaded region in the figure where ABCD is a square of side 14 centimeter and APD and BPC are semicircles. So we are given a square ABCD in which APD and BPC are semicircles. So side of square ABCD is equals to 14 centimeter and diameter of semicircles APD or BPC equals to 14 centimeter. Because you are seeing the square of the square side is the diameter of the semicircles. So diameter of semicircle APD and BPC will be same as the side of square that is 14 centimeter. Therefore radius of semicircle APD and BPC will be half of side that is 14 by 2 that is 7 centimeter. So now area of shaded region will be area of square minus area of two semicircle. So area of square that is side square and area of two semicircle will be area of circle. So you can see 2 2 will be cancelled. So we will have area of circle. So side of square that is 14 centimeter so 14 square here and pi 22 by 7 and radius is 7 so 7 into 7 7 7 will be cancelled so 14 square become 196 and 22 into 7 become 154 so after subtracting we will get 42 centimeter square as the area of shaded region and this is all about worksheet number 54 so if you learn from this video then please do subscribe my channel and share this video as much as you can thanks for watching